Whatever happened to predictability? The milkman, the paper boy, the evening TV. You miss your old familiar friends, but waiting just around the bed. Good morning, Raiders. It's Kelsey. And I'm Aspen, and welcome to the Daily Announcements. It's a good day to be a South Sumter Raider. Starting out our news today, we have the Entrepreneurs' Competition. Online entries for the 2022 Sumter's Future Entrepreneurs' Competition are open until February 16th. Ninth through 12th grade students enrolled at SSHS are eligible to participate. Email Ms. Salenti for more information. Also, Day Do Trash Pickup will take place on February 21st. Meet at Premier Medical at 8 a.m. After the event, participants will be meeting at Dade Park for a wonderful brunch. So, remember Literacy Week? Well, did you know there was a raffle to guess how many books there were in the library? Jonathan Rivera guessed the closest, only off by 300 books. As for Patricia Doyle, she was the winner of the library raffle. Come to the library to get your prize. Now for our seniors. Make sure you send your precious senior memories to the photo circle or straight to Piper Kesey if you want to be included in the senior video. Also, keep an eye out for the Radiant Raider Breakfast Club. Delicious coffee, juices, and donuts are provided. Weekly grade tracking is required to stay active and on track for graduation. Plus, it gets you entered for monthly drawings. Give it a shot if you haven't stopped by yet. That's all for senior news. Now to Seth for sports and weather. Hey guys, Seth here with your sports and weather updates. Today's weather is a high of 78 with a low of 50 and a chance of rain that is 2%. So it's probably not going to rain. The sunshine is finally back, everybody. And however, according to the groundhog, or as one of our cast members call it, the really? dirt raccoon, winter will be lasting another six weeks. So uh, be sure to keep an eye on the weather forecast. We'll, we'll be right here giving it to you. Do you like to perform, dance, have fun, learn new skills, and make new friends? Well, come be a part of the most visual part of the SSHS Raider Marching Band. Color Guard tryouts will be the week after spring break, March 14th through the 18th, 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. Please see Mr. Perone in the band room to sign up. You can also get more information from any current members. Now, let's get straight into the Raiders Sports Report. Starting off strong, let's give a warm congratulations to the boys weightlifting team for winning both traditional meet and first ever snatch event over Leesburg and Crystal River. Starting with the snatch, let's give it up for Chase Zukoski, Bobby Hill, Jackson Sovercool, Tristan Seagrass, and Brock Kinley, who were ranked first place. In traditional, we had six students bring home first place ranking. Yeah. So give it up for Chase Zukoski, Bobby Hill, Jackson Sovercool, Isaac House, David Barnes, and Cody Whitaker. Nice job out there, guys. Now, if you're feeling like showing your support for our team, maybe you should should uh, maybe you should consider trying out for cheer. Cheer tryouts will be March 14th through the 18th, from 4:30 to 6:15. The parent meeting, which is mandatory if you wish to try out, will be February 15th at 6 p.m. Tryouts will be in the gym, and the meeting will be in the Raider room. For further questions, see Stephanie Moffitt. And that's all we have for today. Back to Kelsey and Aspen in the studio. Oh, thanks, Seth. Today's lunch will be Asian chicken <laughs> and rice. If you aren't feeling it, though, we'll have burritos in the other line. And if you're still hungry after lunch, the Interact Club se is selling healthy snacks all of this week and the next. Come to Lab A during Raider time or to Mr. Hansen's room in between classes to buy all your Gatorade, Pop-Tarts, chips, and so much more. All the proceeds will go to charity, so come fill your belly supporting a good cause. That's all we have for today. Remember, Raiders are respectful. Respond.